What we know is a drop. What we don't know is an ocean. Live your life as an exclamation rather than an explanation. Gravity explains the motions of the planets, but it cannot explain who sets the planets in motion. All knowledge and understanding of the universe was no more than playing with stones and shells on the seashore of the vast imponderable ocean of truth. Truth is ever to be found in the simplicity, and not in the multiplicity and confusion of things. Atheism is so senseless. When I look at the solar system, I see the earth at the right distance from the sun to receive the proper amounts of heat and light. This did not happen by chance. If I had stayed for other people to make my tools and things for me, I had never made anything. If I have seen further than others, it is by standing upon the shoulders of giants. Poetry is a kind of ingenious nonsense. To explain all nature is too difficult a task for any one man or even for any one age. I do not know what I may appear to the world, but to myself I seem to have been only a boy playing on the seashore. No great discovery was ever made without a bold guess. I do not feign hypotheses. Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Tact is the art of making a point without making an enemy. Pictures, propagated by motion along the fibers of the optic nerves in the brain, are the cause of vision. I know not how I seem to others, but to myself I am but a small child wandering upon the vast shores of knowledge, every now and then finding a small bright pebble to content myself with while the vast ocean of undiscovered truth lay before me. I can calculate the motion of heavenly bodies, but not the madness of people. All my discoveries have been made in answer to prayer. In the absence of any other proof, the thumb alone would convince me of God's existence. To arrive at the simplest truth requires years of contemplation. Nature is very consonant and conformable with herself. A man may imagine things that are false, but he can only understand things that are true, for if the things be false, the apprehension of them is not understanding. My powers are ordinary, only my application brings me success. I do not think that this, the universe, can be explained only by natural causes, and are forced to impute to the wisdom and ingenuity of an intelligent.